So why did this indictment land now? I don't mean to, I'm trying to be conspiratorial, but take a look at some of the headlines. Trump and the sex offender. Epstein arrest is a worry for Donald Trump. Why the Trump White House is caught up in the Epstein scandal. And here's MSNBC's never Trumper, Nicole Wallace and crew. You're dealing with industrial strength pedophilia. This cannot be just brushed off. It is not trivial. There's no possible case. There'll be a lot of whataboutism, but nobody's going to brush it off. And uh, underscoring Bob's yes. point that we, we will ultimately find out what yeah. Trump knew and when he knew it. <laughs> Joining me now is Dinesh D'Souza, conservative commentator, filmmaker. Dinesh, isn't it amazing how little attention is being paid to the alleged pedophile in this case versus Trump? Uh, absolutely. Trump's culpability here is nothing more than having said, hey, Jeffrey Epstein's a fine fellow and he likes the attractive women. Now, that's a, that's a reckless statement. I don't think Trump knew what Epstein was up to at the time. But there's a complete difference between idle talk on the one hand, or even Acosta's allegedly negligent prosecution, and the people who participated in this sex ring. Uh, and here, I think one name that seems kind of conspicuously absent is Bill Clinton. Uh, we're learning, first of all, that Clinton took a number of flights, a lot more than we yeah. thought, to Epstein's sort of sex island. Yeah, uh, I'm going to get to of that, course, Dinesh. denies it, I, but— Right. I want to put this out there, Dinesh, before you finish that thought, because— Clinton's team put out a statement yesterday that in part reads what Dinesh is talking about. In 2002 and 2003, President Clinton took a total of four trips on Epstein's airplane. Secret Service detail traveled on every leg of every trip. But Dinesh, the Washington Examiner, reporting tonight that the flight logs reveal Clinton took 27 flights on Epstein's private jet during at least six different trips, two of which were without Secret Service agents. So how much coverage, Dinesh, will this one get? Well, what do we know about Clinton? Number one, we know that he's a liar. And number two, we know that he's a sex predator. We know this from independent evidence. And so, therefore, this is worth looking into. So while the media is focused on Trump uh, and Acosta, uh, the Clintons, who have eluded the posse for 40 years, uh, are not even being called to account on this one. There's a photo in social media of uh, uh, Ghislaine Maxwell, the kind of uh, procurer of young women for Jeffrey Epstein. There she is in the front row at Chelsea Clinton's wedding. So there's a clear connection here, a documented connection, and we'll have to find out who's lying, Clinton or the, or the airline logs. Well, maybe they, or they tried to bleach bit the airline logs, Dinesh. Maybe that's exactly what they did. Prediction. Will, th will you learn any more about the Clintons, yes or no, and the involvement of Bill Clinton here? Well, let's remember that it's, these are the New York prosecutors, and they're in the Clinton camp. So they're going to be reluctant to focus yeah. on Clinton. The Clinton Foundation is apparently shielding material. Digital media, by the way, has been scrubbing pictures of Bill Clinton and Epstein from yeah. the web. So this is a, these are very troubling efforts to protect the Clintons yeah, they're, once again. They're, it's one big, it's, as usual, scrubbing, scrubbing, scrubbing the record. Dinesh, thanks so much.